judge basically said that um, the Reuters attorneys basically failed to prove their case, that they failed to prove that this was a case of entrapment, um, that they failed to prove that the, that the Reuters reporters had followed proper media ethics. Um, although it's really interesting, if you look at what went on in the trial, a police captain testified on trial who was a prosecution witness that he and others were ordered to entrap these reporters and ordered to put documents on them. But aside from that, another uh, witness, a police major, testified that these supposedly secret documents were actually not secret because the information had already been published in newspapers previously, before their arrest. So this clearly shows that um, despite these incredible arguments that completely shredded the prosecution's case, that it really seemed to have made little to no difference uh, in the courts in this country. The Reuters team, they do have the option to appeal now to the Myanmar Supreme Court, the highest court in the land. Uh, right after we exited the courthouse, I asked one of the defense attorneys if that's their plan. Uh, he told me they plan to discuss this uh, option over with the families uh, before making a final decision on that. So understandably, uh, I spoke to them just minutes after the decision was handed down uh, and understand that they want a little time to consider everything.